said some slick shit about me in one of your stand up, um, in one of your stand up, you was, you was being sarcastic saying that if Trick Daddy can own a restaurant, you can do anything. Look, well. Nigga, you bull dagging looking ass fuck nigga. Keep my name out your mouth. I'm not no comedian. I'm a street nigga first, okay? Keep my name out your mouth, bitch ass nigga. Keep Ricky Smiley name out your mouth. Keep all OG's name out your mouth. If you Peace, y'all. It's your boy Johnny Fastlane here with allhiphop.com. So right there, that was a clip of Trick Daddy. I mean, he was talking to Cat Williams, right? So y'all know the whole situation, man. Cat Williams was on Club Shay Shay, and he went viral. I mean, he was talking about everybody from Cedric the Entertainer, Steve Harvey, everybody, right? Um, Some of the people that he talked about were also rappers, right? One of the rappers was Trick Daddy. Well, he didn't really talk about Trick Daddy during the interview, but Trick Daddy was upset because he talked about Ricky Smiley, right? Also, during one of Cat Williams' stand-ups a couple of years back, a uh, Cat Williams did say something like, well, if Trick Daddy can own a restaurant, then anybody can own a restaurant, right? Which was funny as hell, so Trick Daddy took offense to that and decided to respond now because, of course, Cat Williams is going viral, right? He also said, keep Ricky Smiley's name out your mouth. Also, I'm not one of these comedians. I will slap the dog shit out of you, right? I'm as crazy as hell because a lot of people are upset about Cat Williams. Williams' interview with Shannon Sharp. Um, somebody else that was upset was Ludacris, right? So during the interview, uh, Cat Williams basically said that it was two light-skinned dudes with an afro and sideburns with the things on the side. He's talking about himself, Cat Williams, and Ludacris, right? And he said that somebody offered both of them $200 million to do uh, 20 movies. Basically, they'll get paid $10 million each for the movies, um, and you get like an ugly-ass light-skinned wife or whatever like that. Um, but of course, you have to sell your soul and Cat Williams said look I didn't do that and the other person was ludicrous right um so obviously you guys know that Fast and Furious 10 just dropped and so Cat Williams is insinuating that ludicrous did the deal so he could get that money and be in Fast and Furious and everything right I'm as crazy as hell because really and truly ludicrous has not been in all 10 Fast and Furious movies um but it's funny so ludicrous actually responded with a freestyle um over like an old Kanye West beat right I mean basically he said I've never been Illuminati because uh, Cat Williams accused, uh, accused him of being Illuminati. Um, but then he also said, "You need, uh, yeah, I got the afro and the sideburns. That's my signature. He was like, um, addictions that arise, comedians check your temperature, right? Basically saying like, this dude must be on drugs or something, right? I'm as crazy as hell because everybody's responding to Cat Williams. It's funny. He definitely is going viral and hopefully he will seize this opportunity to get more work. But um, yeah, let me know what y'all think about this in the comments.